All right, hello, fun, and welcome back to my Tuesday Night Live stream of Kingdom Come Deliverance, where today, ha oh boy, we're going to be continuing where we left off in the last episode, where I made mistakes. <laughs> oh, was stealing that axe from that one dude, I got just so impatient because it was taking so long for that guy to move further away, that I decided to steal it when I obviously shouldn't have, and... And now we're wanted, have been beaten and bloodied by the town guard, and I'm debating whether or not we should just go to jail for a little bit. We're still in the tutorial section, so I don't assume that's going to affect how things play out from here, but it may. It may. <laughs> <laughs> let's see let's see if we can actually finish off these things while still having a bounty on our head uh and then if we can't we'll uh we'll just accept the jail time <laughs> uh, i really should have waited longer but we were heading towards the end of the last episode that one dude just took so long to cut his wood and then move down the line i was like oh, let's just let's just grab it and that was a mistake that was a mistake if you're gonna thieve you gotta be patient and i ha boy when streaming am not patient <laughs> Oh, well, well, let's head out of here. We're back home after our mother patched us up, so let's head on back out into the world and see if we'll get caught by the catch pole. Oh, jeez, we are... We just, we've really messed things up, haven't we? <laughs> oh, well, such is life in an RPG. Sometimes things go nicely, sometimes they go entirely sideways. All right, so let's... Oh, actually, hold on. Before we actually head back down into, like, the main street of the village, do I actually still have all the stuff I stole? Yeah, Kunish's axe, his hammer, and his nails. So I assume we go to a blacksmith and sell, sell them, though I'm worried that they're stolen. I'm worried that they're stolen. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Okay, well, oh my god, we are so bloody, and I have no idea how to clean our clothes yet. <laughs> I know we can, you know, go and wash our face and whatnot, but my god, our clothing. Oh boy, <laughs> that, is, that is a lot of blood. Okay, well, let's go see if we can go to the blacksmith uh, down here that we saw last time, and see if we can sell those things that we stole from Kunash. And stealth, but the face makes a great shield. Ha! <laughs> I was about to keep continue running, but then I saw this guard right here. We probably should stay behind the guard, shouldn't we? Hmm. Yes, be 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 stealthy for a change instead of our usual. All right, hello, sir. Can I sell things to you? <laughs> Hi. How are you? You're the blacksmith guy, right? Well, let's trade. Okay, can I sell you the things? Oh my god, I can. Yes. Oh. 4.3? <laughs> That's it? That's all we're going to get from selling those things to this dude? How the hell was Kunish not able to pay our father back? Oh my god, how... how much are things gonna cost to get the charcoal we need I mean if us getting this money is what we needed for the charcoal I've already got enough huh you know maybe we should check how much the charcoal is first <laughs> and Beastie Bunny that would make sense they're less because they're stolen but what the hell was the point of getting them back then? I thought the whole point was to get these things back so we could get the money for the uh, for the charcoal. We should probably check what the charcoal costs. Let's go do that. Yes, exit the shop. Dang it! Uh, oh, 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 hello, town guard man. Oh God, no! Stay away from him. <laughs> Saw him right there. Stay away. Hide in the tavern briefly. Got it. Got it. I think we're good. He's over there now. Yeah, how much does a charcoal cost? <laughs> Hello, charcoal salesman person. Hi. Good day. Yeah, good day to you too. So, let's trade. Uh, so we need 10 charcoal. 
Which would be five. Oh, okay, yes. But selling those things actually would have helped. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Let's haggle, see if we can get it for lower. <laughs> Let's haggle while I'm while I'm a wanted man. Let's try for 4.5. He's wanting five. Yeah, let's try that. Make offer. Satisfied? Well, a little more and we'll call it a deal. What's your little more? I can do that. I'm okay with that. Yeah. I knew we come. Oh, that guard's waiting behind me, isn't he? <laughs> oh, he is! He is! <laughs> Run away! I have the charcoal. Run away! <laughs> We probably should have just let him catch us, but no, never. Okay, I'm gonna go. Let's see if we can like go through here. Jump! Haha! -ha! Yes! Haha! -ha, we broke combat. Yes, perfect. <laughs> Over we go, magnificent. Okay, okay, okay. We st I should have sold. I should have sold the stuff from Kunash. I should have stole sold the stuff from Kunash. Now we're all the way on the wrong side of town. <laughs> we gotta go to the blacksmith. Oh my god, yes. We are going to finish this tutorial area with a bounty on our head. Perfect. <laughs> I'm a fool. Oh god, guard right there. Hmm, that's not good. Well, go this way. Alright, and Jay should have stolen Kunash's stuff last. I mean, yeah. <laughs> well, honestly, I should have just waited. I should have just waited. Like I was saying earlier, I got too impatient with uh, waiting for him to move. Which is the problem whenever, you know, you're recording or streaming. You don't want to waste time with things. And if they're taking freaking forever for something to happen, you're going to end up just, you know doing something you shouldn't have when you're streaming or recording. Oh, but yeah, I should have waited longer. I should have waited. Oh, well. All right, all right. Where are we at here? Oh, that's the blacksmith's tent right there. Yeah. Still going to sell Kunash's stuff. I don't want it. I don't need it. Can I hide in there? No. You know what? We should steal other people's things while I'm here. <laughs> we already have a bounty. Why not get more? <laughs> Ooh, that's lockpick. Very easy. Get it. Oh, yeah. Oh, hello. Ooh, lockpick hard. I don't have the lock yet. I don't got the skills for that. Dang. Whoops. Didn't mean to punch a barrel. <laughs> oh, a bl I should have had this when I went to go do that fight. Oh my god, yeah, take everything. Heck yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, hello. More apples? Hell yeah. We're a thief now. <laughs> we made our choice. We made our choice. Oh yeah, steal all those cabbages too. Beautiful. Beautiful. We got the bounty. What's what's a little bit more of a bounty on our head? <laughs> Whose home is in here? No one's. Okay, nothing of importance. We can sleep on that bench apparently back there. Weird. Ooh, Ooh some straight up cash in this one. Nice. All right. I'm out. Beautiful. All right, let's get the blacksmith. Okay, okay. Do we see a guard? Do we see a guard? I've stolen all sorts of new things. Also, you, sir, I stole some cabbages. Would you like some stolen cabbages? <laughs> Let's talk super quick. I'm not even going to haggle. We're just going to sell them cabbages and the apples. Yes. Huh. Oh, you'll take the boar hide too? Oh, look at that. You don't, I mean, you do have the money for it. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, you do have the money for it. I'm going to sell it. Sell those cabbages, too. Heck, yeah. Let's get ourselves some money. Dog skins? That doesn't seem like something that's... Oh, hey. He'll, he'll buy these, too. Nice. We don't got to get to the blacksmith. Oh, my God. Excellent. 
And the sheepskin. Oh, yes. We've sold all of our ill-gotten gains except for the bludgeon because I could probably use a weapon. Wish. <clears throat> Wish I would have had that when fighting the one dude. <laughs> Just bludgeoned him. Yeah, that would have been fun. Oh, well. <laughs> in sci-fi, it's like watching the old thief game. I mean, we can thieve in this quite clearly. You know, maybe we should just sell that still. I don't think we have any more fighting left in us. Yeah, let's keep it for now, just in case. Okay, let's let's just close the deal. Close the deal. I don't even want to haggle. We made a lot of money there. You want to get me in trouble? Don't try selling me stolen goods. Oh. Hey, you. Oh crap! <laughs> Guard. <laughs> no, never. I will not halt. Oh crap! So we can't sell those things. Dang. How the hell were we supposed to get the money from Kunesh? Oh god, he's still there! But I don't have the fighting icons! Well, that's not good. No, there they are now. Never! Oh, no, okay, we're... Okay, broken off of them again. Okay, run away, run away. I am super low on stamina. Alright, go up here, go up here, go up here. I think we might have lost him. Yeah. Oh, no, we didn't. It's back to yellow. Crap. Ow. Oh, God. Ow. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Okay. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, we couldn't sell those things to those people. Seriously, how the hell are you supposed to... If you're meant to either, you know, beat that one Kunesh dude in a fight or steal the crap, how are you supposed to get the money if you can't sell the stuff because they're stolen? And how does that dude even know they're stolen? <laughs> well, we gotta go back to where we were. That's unfortunate. Hmm. And Beastie Bunny, you're supposed to win the fight. Well, screw that noise. What if you're not a fighter character? What sort of crappy RPGs? <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna go buy the stuff. You know, maybe we should just go to jail. Maybe we should just go to jail and get it over with for now. <laughs> I'm annoyed by that, though, because it gives you the option to steal back the stuff. That's why I gave you the whole search for the things. But if you can't actually sell it to get the money, what the hell is it good for? Actually, hold on. Can we... Oh, God. Guard. Guard, 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 guard. Oh, he heard me immediately. Father, <laughs> will you just take the stuff back? About the things you wanted? About time. Have you got everything I wanted? No. I got everything from Kunesh. Oh, that's what we were supposed to do. Kunesh didn't want to pay, so I got no money for those things you sold him. But I took them in lieu of the debt. Uh -huh. Took, meaning he gave them to you, or took, meaning stole. Stole. He didn't pay. He was a thief first. How can you steal something that's yours? Fair point. Give it to me, then, and here's some money for the rest. Oh, sweet. That's what we were supposed to do. Hey, you! Oh, hi! Oh, hi! Okay, surrender. Yeah, surrender. for your law breaking. I've surrendered, sir. Someone saw you stealing. Uh-huh. This definitely won't come cheap. You learn crime doesn't pay. I mean it really does though, and sometimes. Okay, you know what? You know what? Um I don't got the money. That's too much. I don't have that much coin. Well, it's a jail cell for you then. Okay. I agree. Jail? Alright, let's go and get it over with quick. Okay, Just the quick. accommodation for you. Get moving. Okay, let's see what happens. <laughs> all the stuff you stole. Can't! I gave it to my father! Ha 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 ha! Take that, you fool! <laughs> yes, I found a loophole. Well, I found what we were supposed to do. We shouldn't have sold the things. We gave the tools back to our father. There it is. I just figured we were supposed to sell the things. It didn't tell us to take it back to our father. But all right, into the dungeon we go. And stealth, we can't go to another town right now. We're in the tutorial section still. Oh. 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 Uh-oh. <laughs> so, the attack that's going on if we're in the dungeon when our parents die. How's this how's this pan out? Oh, does this not work out for us? <laughs> Are we going to die in this dungeon? Hmm. 
Oh, that's smoke. We're gonna... And there we go. End of the series. We've died. <laughs> no. No, okay. We just gotta continue running from the police then, apparently. Unless... Well, what happens after this? Game... <laughs> We died in jail. <laughs> okay, you know what? Uh, load game to get us back to where we originally started off on. Uh, there we go. <laughs> oh my god, that was hilarious. Okay, okay, so we can't go to jail. We have to just avoid the police. Cool. <laughs> there we go. We go straight to our father and then go handle the other things by dodging the cops. <laughs> Oh my god, that was great. Oh, I didn't realize that was a thing. Cool. Okay, stay away from the guards. All right. Hello, father. I have Kunesh's things. So, yeah, about the stuff. Yeah, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Got the Kunesh things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, go through quick. I lost more reputation. We do not have a good reputation starting out this game. We just keep losing more and more reputation. <laughs> Beautiful. And Jay, I would try a new run. Nah, man, we, we've we've made our choices. For good or bad, we've made our choices. Alright, let's keep rolling. We're a, we're a rogue now. We're a rogue person. Yeah, that's 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 what our character is now. We've we've lived a you know, we had a, a charmed life with a wonderful mother and father, but somehow things went wrong for us. <laughs> and by somehow I mean mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the charcoal, dude. Stay well behind that guard. Alright, I think we're still good. We're still good. Stay behind him. We gotta go finish off that quest. We got the other thing over there, too. So, oh boy. I got plenty of money. Alright, hello, charcoal salesman! Be quick about oh, it, sir! <laughs> I need to get out of here quick before the guards come! Okay. Got it. No need in haggling, just go. Close the deal. I'm out. <laughs> go meet up with our friends over yonder. Oh god, I'm stuck in the bushes! I'm stuck in the bushes! <laughs> okay, let's give a wide berth to Kunash here. No, he's not even there. Neat. Alright. Finish up our thing with these guys, then we gotta go get some ale for our father at the tavern, and then we're good. Hey guys, how's it going? You all suck. You didn't help me. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. Did we, though? <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. Did he? True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. I mean, they already know it's us. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. I mean, if anyone jail? Really likes the Deutsch. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. Mm-hmm, <laughs> mm-hmm, sure. All right, well, that was finished up with them. Good, good, good. <laughs> now let's get to the tavern and get the ale uh, for our father and then try and make it back towards up there with the... Uh, without getting caught. <laughs> All right. Pay attention to where there's a guard. Okay, guard's down there. Guard's down there. We're good. We're good. We're good. Let's do this. No, oh, God, there's a guard coming towards us. Run. <laughs> there's a back way into the tavern. We'll go over here. Beautiful. Oh yeah, we're a rogue character now. <laughs> you know, I was originally, like I was saying when we did last episode, I was going to go with kind of a, my plan was like a ranger kind of character. Yeah, yeah, some sword play, but I really wanted to go with archery. Now we're, we're straight up rogue at this point, it seems. <laughs> Where's our lady? Oh, Bianca, hi! You're the one I need. Dave, my lovely. You're looking well today. I'm not, though. I'm bloody as hell. What brings you here? You're calling me handsome when I'm covered in blood? Oh, uh, you know what? You do, my dear. Your beauty, of course. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? Oh, that'd be ale. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely ale. I mean, Deutsch is saying some stupid things, though. The Deutsch is mouthing off again. Oh. And talk to me about him. He's a good customer. Uh -huh. But when it comes to politics, he's unbearable. 
The number of times I had to throw him and the others out so they wouldn't start brawling. Oh my. Well, I'd say he's in exceptional form today. Mm -hmm. And yeah, now a pitcher for my father. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Yeah, sure. Right. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Thank you, Bianca, my dear. You're the best. And I'm well away from the guards, so yay. Thanks. <laughs> it's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. I mean, I would oh, love to, but that ain't happening because go. everything's going this wrong soon. I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. What oh. shifty looking fellow? I suppose. He is a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? I don't know. He used to teach me how to use a sword. Oh, that dude. Yeah, We've already dealt with him. Be to you. Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. I mean, let's be honest. Our father and others are probably... I've got something special. Oh, special? Is that so? Now, what would that be? Your favorite, savor your schnapps. Oh, I do love really? some good schnapps. You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. We won't, though, because everything's going to hell. Yay, save your schnapps, the way to save the game. <laughs> okay, now I gotta get back home without getting caught. All right, we got this. We got this. Well, we already know that this uh, place is getting burnt down soon, so I'm uh, hoping that our bounty that's on our head it just goes away. <laughs> we were we were in jail. Oh, God, there's a guard. There's a guard. He's coming this way. Oh, over we go. We were in jail, and the whole place burned down. I kind of figured that's where things were going. I vaguely remembered that, but all right. So, yeah, now, now though, we don't got to worry about our bounty. Which does make me feel like I should steal everything in this village while we're here now. But, but, let's actually make some progress on the story. <laughs> yeah, up we go. Perfect. I'm gonna go over here. Uh, Toad, when it gets burnt down, goddamn spoilers. I mean,. I kind of knew that was already coming, but yeah, the going and getting in prison bit and everything burning down really sealed the deal there. Hi, Father. I got everything. <laughs> and about the things. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? I do. I have. Yeah. So not yet if we needed to do, if we wanted to do more like the sword training or steal everything. But, but, let's do it. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Mm -hmm. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Ale well first. Done. Okay, okay. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master and Sassel did for us. Oh, hey, our clothes are clean now. Magical. <laughs> we were super bloody a little while ago. Well, that's what I call craftsmanship. Oh, it does look pretty good. What does the inscription mean? Damn if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Rudzig ordered it. Oh my god, that just reminded me of that section there. We this we can actually we don't know how to read in this game, but we can learn to read. Job, I remember that. Good. Oh my. We'll put it all together. We're gonna have to figure that out later. It's probably gonna take us a fair few episodes before we can do that. That's probably gonna take a lot of money for us to do. Hmm. By the all way, right. Someone paid me a call. Was it the guards? I reckon you might know what it was about. Was it the guards? I'm not sure. Really? It was the guards, wasn't it? Because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. Oh, that's not Until nearly as bad of a earlier. thing that they would have come to you talk to you about compared to what I did otherwise. What got into you, Hal? That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the king. He got what he deserved. He got what he deserved, did he? Mm hmm. You so heard about that, but not the, the theft. Made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's fair. Look me in the eye, Henry. I can't. I'm tending to the fire. 
do you understand? I understand. Good. And we'll never have this conversation again. I mean, we won't because everything's about so you to think burn. It's right to let traitors speak ill of our king. The boy gets caught making a fool of himself, and he still hasn't learned his lesson. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and war. You turn into a common thug. I mean, I've done more than that. <laughs> you might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I mean, I did go into some speech, but that nah, didn't help us. The furnace is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. Okay. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You Sweet. know what you're doing. All right. Let's get everything on this cool new sword. That's for the local lord. Do it. Good. Once more. That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the garb. Okay. Father, why did you leave Prague? Oh, he was in Prague you before? Heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good question. I had my reasons, Hal. But, but were they? If you were a master yeah, swordsmith in freaking Prague. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles, had a bridge made over the Moldau, and founded a university. And all without a war. Neat. Knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. I mean, that's fair. That's very fair. What about Sigismund? You think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here. And we'll put it all together. What a beautiful sword. Indeed it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Oh, hey, Thank those nails. Oh, yeah. I got those in my inventory. Ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. Yeah, I already grabbed them last time. I forgot about them, though, so that's good. <laughs> hey, Teresa, I already got them. Hi, how are you? Here are those nails you wanted. Oh, God, I'm back to bloody. Thanks. <laughs> so, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. There's a dance this evening? Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That sword is Henry, truly what beautiful. Are you waiting for? Bring those nails. Yeah, my father's telling me to bring the nails. I'm literally talking to her about the things. And we're... Okay, I thought we were all about Bianca. Why are we staring at her like that? <laughs> Fine, last, eh? Sure. Now, stop staring at her and come and see this. I thought we were all about Bianca, though. What the hell, Henry? Oh, Father, we shouldn't be moving far away from the from the blacksmith shop here. I'm a wanted man. Neat. <laughs> we did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned. Oh hi! Oh God, he has guards behind them. Don't mind me, fellas. <laughs> 
haven't lost your skills, though. I so would. A sword to a Let try it. We're gonna mess it up royally, aren't we? I mean, obviously. Oh yeah, look at that's just ah oh, horrible form, sir. Horrible form. You still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. Since you're the man who ran but from who Prague, knows the hell. What the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. If almost, what? Polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Oh, okay, Excellent. I need the polishing. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. Well, what happened in Nicopolis? How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. I'm yeah, intrigued by that, too. No problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. Which I want to know! I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls, and I must leave. Okay. Here. Bye, guy. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm sure our paths will cross again. They certainly will. Where the hell's that dude? Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Will do. Good work, Martin. Sure. All right, cool. It's been an honor, Seisman. Have a safe journey to Sassau. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. Okay, okay. So we're gonna meet that dude again at some point, right? In Sassau. Long peculiar history. I want to know that this history. A long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Oh, come on! You're gonna die soon, most likely. Me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said. Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. Oh. Mm -hmm, you know mm -hmm. the trouble with an adventurous life, son. It can end before it gets started. I mean, that's I fair, teach but. You how to handle a sword. And then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. Your man has a point. Talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them. Meet. Or beat, either or. <laughs> Then you've no need to learn swordplay. Oh. oh, things are happening now. Things are accelerating into hell. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Well, yep, here it comes. <laughs> Everything goes wrong now. Nice. Hello, large army. Who are you? Are you Sigismund's people? Are you? I don't know. Well, they're about to attack us. And now our family dies, and we survive somehow, obviously. Because otherwise, <laughs> what would the game be? <laughs> 1996, too bad you can't mention that you have a bounty and ask for pardon. Ha! <laughs> that would be hilarious. Oh, all the arrows raining in. Listen to me, Hark. Listen carefully. Uh -huh. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry. And what about you? Okay, to the house first. Also, close the gates, people. You literally have a fortified town here in a castle. Close the also, gates. Why did no. everyone run from it? Do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Radzik. If anything happens, we'll take care of you. He owes me. Oh, he owes you. Okay, okay. I really need to know your story, father. You obviously have a good one. Oh, now you close. Now you close the gate? <laughs> well, after you should have. Oh, well, we took things that I'd already stolen. Let's be honest. Yeah, you guys should have closed the gate ages ago. 
Not now, but now, of course, video game. Uh huh. Uh huh. Move in, people! Come on! Come on! Come on. Oh, Henry! Thank God! Get inside quick! We have to shut the gate! Yeah, get inside, Henry! Mind this for me. Yep, no, nope, he's not. He's not. Of course he's not. You're a fool, me! <laughs> Why are we going back into the village? Everyone's going into the castle! Why are our parents in the market? Our parents were up, you know, at the house. We literally saw them. Our father's pretty good with the sword, though. Damn, nice. He's, I mean, obviously, they're both going to die here. But why were they in town? We literally saw them <laughs> by the castle. Oh, yeah, our father's pretty good. Damn, nice. Good job, you. And now we watch them die. Yep, oh, there it goes. The cataclysm and the armors are just perfect. They do look amazing. Too bad they seem to be doing nothing for the strikes these people are doing. Always a pet peeve of mine in, like, everything. When, you know, in any form of media, armor means nothing. <laughs> the whole point of armor is to protect you, and yet... Games, movies, TV shows, it's all just... Like, paper mache <laughs> Hello, sir. I'm obviously going to try and get vengeance against you at some point. But, not now, I guess. Yeah, Henry, you damn fool. Also, why isn't there a second gate in that obvious gatehouse? <laughs> I know I'm nitpicking, but come on, it's an obvious gatehouse. Why is there no, like, gate there, too? Oh, well. You really? You told me to run to the castle, and now you're doing this to me? Damn you! Okay, we're fleeing now. Got it, got it, got it. Alright. And Galatos, we didn't even go to try and save Bianca. We went to just watch our parents die. <laughs> Alright, now, now we're escaping. Cool, 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 cool. Let's do this. We're gonna die, aren't we? <laughs> oh. oh, we've got Sir Radzig's sword. Sweet. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Follow the path, run. Run is our quest. All right. Well, everything looks fine down there. There's nothing burning. <laughs> right to Talenberg, get a horse. Got it, got it, got it. I mean, I'm just following this path. Is this the right way? Oh, yep, there's the A down there. I see the quest marker. All right, all right, all right. Gotta manage my, uh, my stamina bar here. Oh, I hear people yelling. You're all on your own! <laughs> okay, so I can obviously try and save this person, but nope, I'm a rogue character. Screw that noise! Uh, whistling, huh? Uh, mount the horse. No! Oh, God, no! Mount the horse! Oh, God, horse riding! <laughs> if we try and save that lady, we're obviously going to die. And sci-fi brave Sir Robin ran away. <laughs> uh, cataclysm, be brave, Henry. I mean, you know what? I'll try and run into them with the horse, but then I'm out of here. Okay, so yeah, and let's actually look at the thing. Caps locked, uh, walk gives your horse a chance to recover. Shift, yeah, double tap shift to gallop faster. Oh boy, oh boy. So shift to canter, double shift to oh, gallop. Oh boy, we're gonna we're gonna die. We are gonna die. All right, I'll try and save this woman by running into these people. Ha ha! <laughs> yes, magnificent. Oh hello, folks. Oh hey, I actually completed that. We helped. Oh, that was Teresa, huh? <laughs> I helped Teresa get away by bravely running into them with my horse. Alright. Jump over this. Ha! No, that didn't that didn't work in the slightest. Oh hey, they're still running after me. Oh cool. Cool, 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 cool. Run like hell. Oh hello, other enemy person. Alright, alright, we should we should yeah, canter. Uh, or gallop rather. 
We, oh god, I'm stuck up I'm stuck on things. Oh no. <laughs> we broke combat though. I have no idea where I'm going. Oh hello, horses who are obviously going to chase after me now. Oh sweet. Where am I going? Okay. <laughs> what? I've been hit by a stray cumin arrow. What? <laughs> So I obviously went the wrong way, huh? Okay, cool. Well, that's... Wow. <laughs> and, uh... Too many, uh, too many Daves, those some festive skeletons. I agree. Oh my god, we're all the way back here? Seriously? Aw, oh, man, come on. Where the hell are we supposed to go, then? Uh... Yeah, what the hell? It just... I just randomly died because I guess I didn't go the right way. What? <laughs> oh my god. We may take a savior schnapps after we save Teresa. That might be a good plan. Because obviously we were able to save Teresa by running into them with a the horse, so we're going to do that again, clearly. As Teresa, I assume, will come back in the future. And Bianca's probably dead now. Nothing we can do about her. But so now Teresa is our is uh, best girl. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Horse riding. Blah, blah, blah. Teresa, I'll save you once more. Ha, ha. All right. All right. Now let's look at the map. Where are we going? Where are we going? Okay, so I need to go. Th I need to go the entire opposite way that I was going. That's why it failed me. I mean, still that sucks that it did that. <laughs> so turn around. Got it. Oh, oh, oh! The oh god! The guys! The guys! Okay, run! Continue to run. Yay! Running away. All right, we completed Teresa getting away again. Magnificent. That's wonderful. And now we just get the hell out of Dodge. We got it. Ooh. Oh, game saved. Oh, boy. All right, hi. <laughs> oh, hello, cumin soldiers. Galdus, you tried to escape by running into the enemy. Yeah. Oh, great. Now we got to deal with, like, horse archers. Oh, wonderful. Oh, and I'm shot. Sweet. So this is cutscene for our escape, or are we going to actually have to do this? We're going to have to do this, aren't we? We're going to have to do this, aren't we? We're going to have to do this, aren't we? <laughs> okay, let's handle this thing. Yep, oh, yep, yep, yep. All right, I'm going to go this over here this way. Yeah, over here. I don't know why, but I thought it might be good. Bob and weave. Rovna, huh? Oh, hello, Rovna. What a beautiful village you have. Too bad it's infected with human soldiers. <laughs> We're going this way, eh? And... Cataclysm? Did we see? Left. Halberg is to the left. Did we see Bianca taking a hit in the cutscene? I don't remember that. Alright. And Galna's flesh wound. Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, an arrow to the leg. Definitely just a flesh wound. Okay, I am bleeding heavily, though. Well, maybe only slightly. And we're hungry, too. That's unfortunate. Oh, they are still following me. Oh, boy. Hello, random man here. Too bad you're slower than me. They're just going to keep going after me. Yep, they're just going after me. Cool. Our stamina's low. Oh, God, our stamina's low. And they're, they're right here. <laughs> Oh, and Cataclysm, thank you for the bits. Oh, God. Okay, okay. His stamina's back a bit. We took a couple of shots. <laughs> okay, our horseman ship has gone up a little bit. Wonderful. Well, this chase scene's not going great for us, is it? Why aren't you going after these innocent people who are just by the road? Go after them, not me, you fools. Horse is low on stamina again. Horse is low on stamina again. Yeah, yeah, hit, hit the other people. All the people who are right here. Oh, God. Hi, guys. 
Yeah, they're just right. They're not very good archers, just staying right behind me with all of this. Oh god, our horse's stamina is just so awful. <laughs> okay, there we go. We can we can gallop again. We are all sorts of bleeding. Good job. These human archers are just awful, though. I mean, they should have just riddled me with holes at this point, but... Oh, oh that was a good one. Oh, they got a good shot on me that time. Okay, but we got to a cutscene. Yes! <laughs> In sci-fi, Splat would have escaped. Donkey would have slain them all. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. Hi, folks! How's it going? Don't mind us! Oh, now you pull out a sword. After all the times I was so slow and you were literally right behind me, now you pull out a sword? <laughs> and too many Daves? I agree, this is way too much effort to kill one lowly, dirty peasant. <laughs> but we did it! We did it! We really shouldn't have been able to, considering they were literally right on our ass. <laughs> Oh well, we've done it. Alright, cool. Yeah, see, they're a similar gatehouse to the one we had. Theirs has a proper portcullis there. Why not ours? Sir Brad's town was just poorly defended. I mean, my god, it was horrible. <laughs> Hi, folks. Who are all of you? <sighs> Don't mind the air on the leg. Someone give him a drink. Oh please. I bring hot wine and bandages. You know, I like you I like you, sir. You're wonderful. So how you all doing? Tell me, boy. Who are you and where are you from? What in hell's name happened? Oh, so many things. Salads. They burned it to the ground. Yo. Uh -huh. Slaughtered everyone. Indeed. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tartars? What up? Tartars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. Sci-fi, fetch the leeches. Ooh, no, please don't. <laughs> Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna pull that hero out. Oh no, you don't want to do. You know, oh boy. Oh, yep, there we go. Well, in T ninety six, we know exactly who they were, considering the death thing. They were humans. So <laughs> Easy. All done. Uh huh. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. Oh, that's good. That's very good. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Mm uh hmm. -huh. Can you stand? There you go. As good as new. Ah, I like him. <laughs> Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? Lord Divish, you say? Got it. To Lord Divish. And Genzek, thank you for the follow. Who lovely hall Lord Divish has in here. Very nicely painted. Sir, this is a survivor from... I heard, Robard. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you Fire, see death, slaughter. Of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? So, um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a, a strange language. They burned scallops to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. Mm -hmm. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. Ah, oh, yes, Sigismund, I knew it. From the east, and now they're the core of his army. Sacking Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Oh my, all right. Scallops is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, Sir Robard. 
and our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. Do you think we're next in line? Oh, most definitely. Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scarlet's blacksmith. I know him. Oh, do you? Did he make it inside the castle? No, he's dead. I'm sorry. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. No problem. Robard, take Get care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Oh, thanks. I'm actually kind of hungry right now, so thank you. Get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. In sci-fi, they still silver. I might go work for them. I mean, could we? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. All right, we've ri we've ridden to Talenburg. We've warned them now. Mm, excellent. Now what? Now what? Well, loading scene, obviously. <laughs> okay. And let's see. Jay will say this. Agility for archery never makes sense. And this game seems to relatively realistic. I've always agreed with that. It actually takes a good amount of strength and stamina to actually shoot a bow. Jilly never made so much sense to me either for those sorts of things. Oh, hey, we loaded. Oh, sweet. Where am I? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> uh, how do, okay, in here. Quest log. Oh, we're still on run, huh? We got to talk to Sir Robert. Sir, Ro Sir Robert was the, co the cool guy, right? Who gave us one and, you know, patched us up. I like him. I like him. Oh, no, that was Divish. That was Divish. No. Divish was the Lord? I've entirely forgotten now. <laughs> uh, my hometown was attacked by foreign soldiers and many people slaughtered. I couldn't get inside the castle before they closed the gates, so they sent me to Talenburg to warn the people there in case they face a similar fate. Cool. So we just got to go, go find... Oh, 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 I'm wibbly wobbly. Oh, boy. All right. Go down here, huh? Oh, I need food and rest. Hello, Sir Robert. I like you. You've done well, lad. Thank you. I'm sorry for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? Sorrow is easier to bear on a full stomach. Cool. All right, yeah, I could really use that. Oh boy, I I'm wobbly. They say he was a swordsman who moved to the countryside to make horseshoes. Uh huh. He is. I don't understand it. I want to know his story. I'm sure he had his reasons. Did he, though? He had a fine reputation. Okay. Cutscene. Ah, milady. You are fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Talmberg has graced us with her presence. Milady. So this is our brave young man. Welcome, lad. Bojana here will take care of you. No doubt you're tired and hungry. <laughs> Indeed. How could he not be, poor soul, after everything he's been through? He must be as hungry as a bear, aren't you, young master? I'm also covered in blood. Can we do something about that? <laughs> Eat your fill. Why, and thank you, you madam. Wash it down. Oh, you, you're lady. the best. When you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer bailey. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly. Thank you, my lady. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Indeed. Yes, yes, thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. Eat up now. You're in capable hands, so I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. Good night, ma'am. And stealth with our mom dead now, who will patch us up when now. Done, oh, God, I know, right? We're going to have to do it ourselves, and we don't know how to. Okay, thank you. You know, I thought you were cool, but then you're, you know, getting my getting my case there with my boots. How dare you? Let's eat. Must eat. I mean, yeah, that's what we're trying to do here. 
Lentil mash! Alright, can I... Are these things steel? Bread rolls? And cheese? Please tell me what happened to the I'm gonna I take all the things. Yeah, roast duck too. Heck yeah, roast duck is delicious. Okay, okay. Into our inventory. Let's eat that soup. Lentil mash! We also have lentil soup from earlier. Hmm. <laughs> well, eat the lentil mash! Uh, our speech and charisma are down because of all the blood, I assume. <laughs> yeah, we still need more food. Yeah, let's eat this lentil soup, too. Oh, my God. We still need more. Okay, eat all the duck as well. Oh, the roast duck did a lot more than the soups. Neat. I'm going to take those bread rolls, too. Yeah, let's take those. And the cheese and the apples. Because, I mean, why not? I learned food, apparently, from the cor <laughs> upper corner. Oh, that was stealing? I re lost reputation. Oh, what? Well, it doesn't showing it as steal. I lost reputation, though, for stealing all their food. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, we are a brigand at this point, let's be honest. <laughs> Everything we've done since the start of this has lost its reputation. <laughs> Everything. Oh, boy. Oh, we actually have some points we could spend. We'll do that next time. What's my... What is our reputation? We're up to zero. Tomberg is 50, surprisingly. Scully, it's 86. Wow, really? <laughs> I would have thought much lower. <laughs> okay, well, let's go to bed. All right, I'm going to go this way. Thank, thank you, ladies, for cooking me a good, lovely meal. I need sleep now. Hello, Sir Dibish. Alright, looks like we're in here. Okay, okay. So that's what's in here. Oh, we're sleeping in here, eh? Ooh, lovely. We got a private room? Nice. Alright, well, I actually think this is a good place for us to end today's episode because um I assume once we sleep, it's gonna immediately go into some other sort of scenario for us, another cutscene. So I think this is gonna be a good place to end. Oh boy, we are super tired. And then in the next episode, we'll continue from here after a lovely night's rest. But hopefully you all have enjoyed, and you do come back for the next. But until that time, thank you for watching as always. We'll have a good one. <laughs>